Joe, can you talk about maybe the, the evolution of your of, of your jump shot so far this year? Um, you know, it's just a confidence thing. Um, we got to work on it in practice. Um, still got to just be a lot more aggressive. Um, but, you know, obviously, um, you know, I've uh, just been working on it. Coach has been uh, continuing to sort of give me tips on uh, consistency and stuff like that. So um, it's just a confidence thing and continue just to um, work on it and just so I can translate to the game. In the Chicago State game, you shot your free throws with your right hand as opposed to your left. Why, why was that? My bad. Um, you know, it was just, you know, obviously I'm, uh, I'm right-handed, um, so, um, you know, it was just, obviously everybody goes through something, so um, I just feel like it was something I needed to do for that time being. Even though you had success last year, left hand, mm -hmm, that stretch where I think you were 17 of 18. <laughs> absolutely, absolutely. Um, <laughs> um, but I just feel like it was just necessary for that this time being, for sure. So, so you were right-handed, but you shot him left-handed last year. Mm -hmm. I'm like born that's your right hand. I throw my right hand, um, right in my right hand, stuff like that. So, so actually, a right-handed person. In what ways do you feel like you guys have improved the last couple of games to prepare you for the test this weekend? Um, you know, just building consistency with, uh, you know, we, I think we had a lot of assisted points last game. I think uh, maybe 20 plus, um, and that's something that. Um, you know, it just builds. You keep building off that. Um, we all, um, we move the ball really well. We played consistent defense yesterday, or say yesterday, the last game. Um, and you know, it just, it just, we just starting to do the little things more often, starting to realize what the little things uh, it's going to take to uh, beat a, a ranked team or a, a team that has, you know, more talent. The fact that we talked you lost to Texas and Marquette, does that put a little bit more emphasis on these next two games, regardless of when you play Saturday, but you get VCU on Friday to, to maybe get that marquee win or that, that noticeable win that people pay attention to? Absolutely. Um, this is our resume builder, and then we're going to just try to, you know, uh, continue to build. Um, obviously, these will be two good, uh, starting off Friday will be a big win for us, and uh, we hope to get that win and move on to the next win, and uh, that will be huge for us. Um, so, um, obviously, going to try to to build, res uh, build our resume before Big Ten starts, and um, um, so you know to get a good turn in uh, position. So like, just with VCU, just they're kind of a helter skelter team in a way, but they're going to put a lot of pressure on the perimeter. And just being able to equip to handle that and keep the turnovers at a, at a reasonable number. Absolutely, we've been working on it in practice. Um, you know, I feel like we've uh, we've learned from our mistakes. We watched that film as a team and as, you know, <coughs> as, as individuals. Um, and I feel like it's just gonna, you know, just translate over. I feel like we're prepared, more prepared now uh, for <coughs> for a team like this and uh, for a game like this as well. So.